you drank yourself onto the table after a little episode with uh, Jeanette. Get out. Don't get upset. We've all had our little episodes with Jeanette. What a dog. Got a kerchief. What time did the, um, the, uh, party finish? About dawn. Well, what time is it now? Around about four o'clock. Four? Oh. No. Look, uh, thanks for the hospitality. I'd better be going along now. See, I am the school teacher at Tabunda. And, um, oh, I lost all my money. Gambling. Yeah, no. Why'd you have to lie about it to Tim Hines? It's now disguise here. In any case, I can't stay in your um, cabin indefinitely, can I? Doesn't mind. I just lived here for five years. Anyway, you're better off here than trying to sponge on men like Tim Hines. On sponge? Yeah, sponge. Sit down, eat your grub. I'm gonna need it. We're going hunting with Dick and Joe. Kangaroo. Hunting? Yeah, we were. Boasting in your tops. Good shot. Said you won a silver medal at school for target shooting. Oh? Uh -huh. Mama. You wouldn't have an aspirin, would you? No, I've got something better. This ought to kill your headache and cut you up a little bit as well. Wash it down with some beer. Huh. Oh, I'm allergic to salt. Ah, there's nothing that will hurt you. Go on, man. Swallow it down. She just opens her mouth and her notes come floating out. Oh, sorry, I'm, I don't smoke, though. Would you like to yeah. try it? No. You've been here five years. Shall I satisfy your curiosity? I'm a doctor of medicine and a tramp by temperament. I'm also an alcoholic. My disease prevented me from practicing in Sydney, but out here it's scarcely noticeable. Certainly doesn't stop people from coming to see me. 
Well, I charge no fees because I'm not interested in money. Anyway, I'm unreliable. But I'm accepted socially because I'm an educated man of a, of a character. I'll get my food from my friends, my requirements in beer, which with some measure of self-control is the only alcohol I allow myself. And you get along without money altogether? It's possible to live forever in the Yava without money. As you probably noticed, some of the natives are very uh, hospitable. Take Jeanette, for instance. Now, there's a very interesting biological case. If Jeanette were a man, she'd be in jail for rape. <laughs> oh, to marriage, and that's just the sort of girl. Excuse me. Uh, can you tell me where the um toilet? Yes. Outside. I wouldn't recommend it. Do it out here in the open. No one around to see. If I were ever to marry, Jeanette's the sort of girl I'd like to marry. She likes sex. She likes experiment and the, she likes variety. We thought about getting married once. But neither of us could live with one person for very long. Still, she visits me from time to time. When I want her. And when she gets bored with them. Beer. What's wrong with a woman taking a man because she feels like it? I really don't know. Because there's nothing wrong with it. Sex is just like eating. It's a thing you do because you have to. Not because you want to. But most people are afraid of it. You seem offended by my little discussion of Jeanette. In the circumstances, I thought you'd be interested. Well, I'm not. You're probably a little Puritan. Like the rest of these people? They think Jeanette's a slut. The women who'd like to act like her. And the men she has given a tumble to. Janet and I are alike. We break the rules. But we know more about ourselves than most people. <laughs> <laughs> 